Voters will have a chance to cast a ballot in Minot next year, but this time around they'll be deciding whether or not to help fund a new $17 million indoor turf space that belongs to the Minot Parks District. City Council members approved a tentative June 10th special election for people to vote yes or no on levying a half percent sales tax. The Park Board estimates that can collect about $6 million a year if that half percent tax is approved by voters. The 29 thousand square foot building that would be connected to the Mesa Arena would service local youth sports groups, Prairie Grit, and the Minot community in general. But the Park District's executive director faced some opposition from some council members after they say they were hearing from several concerned neighbors. I received more calls, texts, and emails last week than I did at any point going forward. We've got nothing left. I think there's other ways to figure out how to build this if this is what the community wants. I think our parks are behind. I think our parks could do a lot better. And I think this allows them that opportunity to do more for our community and the people that come into our community. And it will be up to the voters to decide. And, and, and again, I'm excited to give them that opportunity. The special election was originally planned for April, but was moved to June by the council to ensure that any possible snowbirds can return and take part in that vote. But the June 10th date is still tentative, pending Minot Park Board members and Ward County Commissioners' approval. We are also sitting down with the Park District's Executive Director next week to break down the cost for neighbors and the vision beyond the facility.